For Comedy Hive News, I'm John Ava. As we round out what some may consider as Cat Week, another story related to Cat Williams' interview with Shannon Sharp is making the rounds. On Thursday, hip-hop pioneer and now commentator Willie D will release a new interview with veteran comedian Mark Curry. Mark Curry, who would speak with Comedy Hive back in 2020, is known for being candid in his interviews, and while speaking with Willie, was no different. If you can recall, Cat Williams will point out that Steve Harvey looks to have stolen Curry's career and material during his talk with Shannon Sharp, which now sits at 44 million views. This is a televised joke that Mark Curry helped me punch up. The same Steve that went to go watch Mark Curry do his whole sitcom and then stole everything Mark Curry had. Steve got a sitcom where he the principal and he wear a suit. And then he gets this high top fade making all black men think he got the best lineup in the business. This the same Negro that hated on Bernie with this same thing. While speaking with Willie D Live, Curry would reconfirm that Harvey stole his material. Now, this wouldn't be the first time we've heard Curry speak on Harvey as he would call Harvey a bitch ass during an interview with the Mike Donnie show on Fox Soul in 2019. Well, Steve stole my material on his show, so I had a beef on that. He did all my Halloween material one Halloween. I'm watching that, and I know he didn't think of it. You know, this, this is true stuff that really happened to me. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. And so my thing is, you didn't have to do that, homeboy. Right. So, you know, motherfucker, you made enough money, bitch ass. Why are you on my material? Right. You know, what's that about? Interesting enough, in the same interview, Curry would share that he would confront Harvey over the joke at Netflix's Def Comedy Jam 25 reunion, and would share that Harvey said he didn't know it was his. No, yeah. I, I saw him at the, um, at the, uh, the Def Jam 25. Oh, Def Jam, mm. okay, okay. So when I see you, I step to you, no matter where we at, step to you. Did he apologize? No. Nah. He said he didn't know? Of course. Okay. Just this week, we would confirm that Curry did in fact approach Harvey. While reviewing footage from Def Comedy Jam 25, you can see Curry approaching Harvey on the actual stage during a Dave Chappelle speech. When it comes to his new interview with Willie, Curry would reflect on Harvey stealing material as a bitch move, but also express that maybe it was Steve's writers who took the joke. But he will also go on to say, he knew, you wanna be me, you want my style. Now, as far as Harvey, he would lightly acknowledge the claims on his radio show while mocking Cat Williams' interview with Shannon Sharp. Hold up, Tommy. Hold up, Tommy. So you a comedian, <laughs> you a radio host, uh -oh. yes. and now you got a game show? Oh, you done stole me. my whole damn career. <laughs> yeah. I'm finna go on Shannon Sharp show and accuse you of you stealing my whole damn there. career. I, I didn't that. know you were supposed to go on there and do that type of stuff. I thought you were supposed to go on there and enlighten people. If you can recall, Curry would star in the hit TV show Hanging with Mr. Cooper for five seasons from 1992 to 1997. Now, when he first spoke to us back in 2020, Curry would reveal why he left TV. I did television and made a mark. I was done. I did it. I like the lifestyle of a comedian. I like Dave Chappelle's career. He doesn't do movies. He don't do nothing. He's just a comedian. In his new interview, Curry would go on to confirm that he is now looking to return with a new sitcom. So let's talk about it more in the comments below. Do you feel Steve Harvey should further respond to Curry's claims? And how do you feel about Mark Curry making a big return to TV? Stay up to date for the latest news and comedy by subscribing here to your YouTube channel and follow Comedy Hype across all social media. For Comedy Hype News, I'm John Oppa. Such a good time. No, nah, that was a good time. Tell me anything. No, nah, I loved it. I loved it. Oh, yo, so you and your homegirl coming through tonight, right? You got games. Yeah, of course I got games. Yeah, I just pulled this game off of the hype market. It's called Comedy Hype. Yeah, me and my cousin were playing it last week with the fam. Yo, we were rolling. Mm -hmm. No, nah, you're going to love it. It's a trivia game. Yes, yeah, yeah, we do points and everything. I mean, you need some help. You can need to redeem yourself anyway from that spades tournament last week. Yeah, you are trash. Okay. <laughs> no, I'm joking. Of course it's fun. All right. Name the queens of comedy. Some more. Mm -hmm. Monique. Mm -hmm. Tiffany. <laughs> nah, nah, you missed one now. That's why you need to rock with me, baby. I got all the answers. We'll see. All right, I'll see you tonight, Ben. Nine, just come at nine. You don't need to come no earlier. That's why everybody getting here. All right. All right, nine o'clock. All right, bye.